Vietnam, a remarkable blend of natural wonders and cultural variety, is fashioned as a long, thin strip of land wedged between the East Sea and Laos, Cambodia, and China. The country of Vietnam has a long history and a multicultural population that includes more than 50 ethnic minority groups which makes travel their rich in cultural heritage. The scenery ranges from jagged peaks seen from winding mountain passes down to verdant paddy fields painted every shade of green in the palette. Even the most slothful may see nature up close on a trip to Helan Bay, Vietnam's most famous natural tourism site. Hiking, cycling, and kayaking are popular sports in the numerous national parks where outdoor enthusiasts may dig their teeth into the terrain. The larger cities hum with contemporary activity and provide plenty of opportunity to bite into Vietnam's delectable culinary delights while the rural parts are filled with magnificent landscapes. This intriguing nation is one of Southeast Asia's most undervalued travel destinations and is full of surprises. Our list of the top Vietnam tourist destinations might help you organize your sightseeing. Number 12, Ninh Binh. Southeast of Hano lies a paradise called Ninh Binh, which has many unexplored regions in the nation. It serves as a jumping off point for people looking to escape the smog and grit of the city. Tam Kok in Ninh Binh, in particular, features magnificent vistas with numerous limestone cliffs and rock formations scattered about among emerald green rice terraces. Tamcock is still only accessible through special means. Setting up a boat and rowing around the lush fields between the cliffs is the nicest way to see the area. Three mountain tunnels that cross the path may be found there. They were created over time by the river itself. Climbing the stairs to Hang Mua Peak for jaw-droppingly stunning vistas of the river slashing through the rice paddies and limestone mountains is another spectacular activity. Number 11, Ha Giang. The emerald green karst mountain vistas along the mountain passes in Ha Giang make it the ideal destination for picturesque road trips by automobile or motorcycle. Particularly, the winding Quan Bia Pass between Ha Giang Town and Tan Son offers expansive views of the Karst Plateau and its jutting limestone outcrops. While the zigzagging Mai Pai Leng Pass between Dong Van and Miovac provides breathtaking views of the lush mountain scenery and narrow valleys below. Plan your trip to coincide with a market day when vendors from the nearby mountain villages swarm into the city. One of the greatest Sunday markets is in Dong Van. Number 10, Phu Quoc. The island of Phu Quoc, which lies 45 kilometers off the southern coast of the nation in the Gulf of Thailand, is heavily wooded but it also has stretches of white sand beach, crystal clear water, very fresh and healthful food, and a laid-back environment that draws a lot of sun bothers during the winter dry season. From Phu Quoc to the island of Han Tom, in the Anto Islands, the Phu Quoc cable car offers aerial views for 8 kilometers as it soars over the seascape and islands. Regular ferries and airplanes connect the mainland villages of Ratchja and Ha Chien with Phu Quoc. Ha Chien is a well-liked first or last stop for overlanders entering Vietnam, since it is so near to the southern border crossing with Cambodia. Number 9. Dal Lot. Those who are sick of the oppressive heat in Vietnam should travel to Dal Lot. Its height of 1,502 meters or 4,928 feet above sea level results in year-round spring-like temperatures of 14 to 23 degrees Celsius or 57 to 73 degrees Fahrenheit. 
Dalat was founded by the French in 1890 as a vacation destination, making it a relatively new city. Thankfully, both the North and South Vietnamese governments decided to leave the hill town alone during the conflict. Consequently, there is a French quarter with several French homes and historic pagodas. Even the summer palace of the emperor is still standing. Dalat is renowned for its lakes and waterfalls as well. From Ho Chi Minh City, it takes a bus 7 to 8 hours. Number 8. Sapa The historical French hill station of Sapa, which is close to the Chinese border, is another must-see location in Vietnam. Try your most hardest to include Sapa in your schedule for Vietnam, despite the fact that the trip there by bus takes 12 hours. You won't soon forget the sight of the terraced rice fields, surrounded by the mountains and deep valleys. This is the ideal location for individuals who enjoy getting outside and trekking. Fansipan Mountain is one of the toughest treks you can take. With countless opportunities to trek or day hike through little towns and take in the breathtaking mountain vistas, this is the best trekking location in all of Vietnam. You may also go to the neighborhood markets to buy fresh vegetables and handicrafts made by the hill tribes. Number 7. Hue Hue, one of Vietnam's oldest cities, is overflowing with artifacts from the Nguyen Emperor's late 19th century rule. The imperial enclosure is a massive structure, surrounded by walls that stretch for 2.5 kilometers, sitting along the banks of the lovely Perfume River. Visit the stunning Ngo Mon Gate, the Tai Hoa Palace with its exquisitely detailed interior, the Dino residence, where the Queen Mothers would reside, and the Halls of Mandarins with their restored ceiling murals while exploring the gardens. A perfume river cruise is one of the most pleasant methods to see a number of distant locations. The Thi Mu Pagoda, with its tower that reaches 21 meters high, is the most significant pagoda in the neighborhood and the greatest tomb to see if you're short on time is the tomb of Tadok. Number 6. Ho Chi Minh Ho Chi Minh City, formerly known as Saigon, is one of the top tourist destinations in Vietnam and is named after the revolutionary of the same name. Actually, if you're flying internationally, you're probably going to land in either Hanoi or Ho Chi Minh City. No trip to Vietnam is complete for large city aficionados unless they visit Ho Chi Minh City, the country's buzzing commercial hub. The streets are clawed with motorcycles and cars. The restaurant and cafe culture is extremely cosmopolitan and the shopping is among the best in the country. Over the years, this enormous metropolis expanded and is today the nation's most populated city. Today, the city is teeming with fascinating locations, including the Benth and Market, the Independence Palace, the Kuchi Tunnels, and the Saigon Notre Dame Basilica. Ho Chi Minh City's cuisine is a fusion of old and new. People in Ho Chi Minh are extremely inventive when it comes to cooking and creating new foods. A cuisine tour in Ho Chi Minh will be an unforgettable experience for everybody, especially at such a low price. Number 5. Hoi An With an abundance of remaining antique buildings, charming Hoi An is the most atmospheric city in Vietnam. The old town section is a delight to explore since it is crammed with well-preserved merchant buildings that date back to the 15th century, when Hoiyang was at the height of its trade center fame and a key meeting place for Japanese and Chinese merchants who came for the local silks. The charming Japanese bridge, which is located at the western end of Tran Phu Street, serves as Hoi as most iconic landmark 
and the assembly hall of the Fujian Chinese congregation, which is located close by, is the temple in the old town with the most elaborate decorations. The town is full with little pagodas and museums, but the best way to experience Hoi is beauty is to just wander around the narrow alleyways of the old quarter and take in its beautifully preserved facade. Number 4. Mekong Delta Before reaching the Mekong Delta in Vietnam, the Mekong River originates in Tibet and travels through China, Thailand, and Cambodia. In order to finally empty into the South China Sea, it splits off into distributaries there. There are several towns in the Mekong Delta that are great for day trips, or as bases for exploring the region. In one town, in Long, you may stay in a rustic homestay along the river and use it as a base to explore the floating marketplaces and islands of the delta. However, Kendo is definitely my favorite Mekong Delta town. You may take a boat trip from here to a pretty cool floating market by traveling down one of the canals. If you want to learn more about southern Vietnamese culture and escape the turmoil of Saigon, the Mekong Delta is one of the greatest destinations to travel in Vietnam. Number 3. Ha Lan Bay Given the genuine beauty of this location, Ha Lan has a reputation that is well deserved. The limestone cliffs outline hints that the name Ha Long means descending dragons. Ha Long Bay is one of the greatest locations to visit in Vietnam and is located close to Hano in the northern coastal part of the nation. It is also a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The many classic sailing boats, beautiful sand beaches, and blue waters combine to create a site straight out of a fantasy. You may witness the breathtaking splendor of this alien bay while taking a day sail through these enormous stones. After that, spend one day swimming in the clear sea and the next discovering caves or some of the farther flung, deserted islands. Now, you can drive from Hano to Ha Long Bay in approximately three hours, and arranging transportation isn't too difficult once you are there. However, if you're up for an adventure, you may also board the bus that departs from Hano city center. Number 2. Hanoi Hanoi is unquestionably the most significant and serves as the capital of Vietnam, despite not being the country's largest metropolis. It's also quite colorful, Vietnamese history dates back over a thousand years, and Hano, a city on the banks of the Red River, has long been a significant commercial hub. Along with many other amazing locations, this city is home to the Ho Chi Minh Mausoleum, Lenin Park, the Temple of the Jade Mountain, and the Vietnam Museum of Revolution. The huge airport close by makes it one of the greatest locations in Vietnam to visit at the beginning or finish of your vacation. If you're visiting any of the street food markets, be sure to chow down on hot pho soup, bun cha pork noodles, and cha sia fish with noodles. Just be hungry when you go to the markets because you'll be full when you leave. Number 1. Bac Sun Valley Vietnam's northern Lang Son province contains the rural area of Bac Sun Valley. 160 kilometers to the northeast of Hana is where it is. One of the valley's fascinating features are its own extraordinarily tall mountains, which range in height from 500 to 1800 meters. The ideal vantage point from which to view these mountains and the valleys, rice fields, is from the summit of a mountain. It is only a few minutes away from the town, the settlements in the Bac Sun area are stunning in their own right. The Tay ethnic group and their customary stilt homes are present in the area. The greatest overnight excursions 
will allow visitors to experience the stunning environment and learn about hill tribal culture. You would have to climb up to the phone station that was built on top of a mountain if you wanted to get the entire view of the valley. From here, the breathtaking 360-degree landscape of mountains, lakes, and farmland utterly astounds you. Travelers may enjoy a variety of activities in Vietnam, including climbing in the highlands, hiking through trails, relaxing in metropolitan nightlife, relaxing on beaches, and enjoying fine dining. Each place in Vietnam has a unique taste that adds to the allure of the experience. And Vietnam offers much more for you to explore along the road than simply the top destinations mentioned above. Prepare well for your trip to Vietnam and be ready for any unexpected events. If you want to visit Vietnam, I've included a recommendation for the ticket in the description box. If you like our video, don't forget to subscribe to Miracle Travels and click the bell icon to get new video updates and get the comment below for your next destination. Thank you for watching.